So we're here at the dog show. This one is the Alaskan Malamute Kennel Club. So it's it's specific for his breed um, and it's the experts in his breed. Um, I didn't realize it, but his dad is here too. So he was a sperm donor dad. So we're gonna meet him. And yeah, Teddy's in the junior class because of his age. Um, and then he makes it through that. Then he gets to go to the, the overall junior. So he competes against males only first of all. And then depending if you, if you get first in that, then you compete against the first of the females. And then after that, if you win that, you get to go to another one. So we're waiting to see. But he's fully groomed. And lots of people have taken pity on our setup because we just weren't prepared. Like, I didn't realize the amount of products they put in their dogs and stuff, like there's a lot. Um, so people are helping us, which I didn't expect because obviously it's a competition, but they're all helping, let borrowing brushes and all sorts. So we're all set up now. We've just got here. We've um, pitched up our crate, although I'm not really using it for Teddy. He's got his little show dog lead on um, and we're just waiting for Freya, who's taking him through the ring, to uh, come over so we can get some practice rounds in. But yeah, this is the one that we're at, the Alaska Malamute Club. It's in Birmingham and we were up at like 5am to get here. But we're here, we made it and we've started doing the grooming and his tail is looking poofier than ever. Um, and we are absolutely ready to smash the competition. Ready? Oh. Are you happy? Oh. 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 Okay, so now we're practicing. Meet Freya. Good boy. Freya has been doing this for years and she kindly offered to take Teddy in the ring for me so I can learn from her. So I'm very, very grateful. Okay, here he is, he's in the ring now, he's about to start. Um, so Teddy is up front with Freya and right behind him you'll see Sonia who is Teddy's breeder and that is Otis, his brother from the same litter. So Sonia decided to keep Otis from a litter of four and um, Teddy's got uh, three other brothers or two other brothers as well as um, Otis and yeah, we've stayed very close contact and this is the show that Sonia thought would be the best one for us to enter for our first ever show um, and she's been helping us along the way as well as Freya we couldn't do it without either of them okay and here we go so this is the judge in the red suit jacket or the burgundy suit jacket um, and what they first start off with is a run around the ring like a little trot to see how they move um, so the handler obviously has to trot with them and fun fact that I didn't know which is why show dogging is sort of complicated the dog has to stay on the left at all times so things like that I just if I had been showing him I might not have got to um, and yeah so this is just trying to see how all of the movement works um, and then she's the judge is comparing the two of them and then they do the stance dance which is the thing that I found the absolute hardest to try and train Teddy with so next up, the judge comes over and checks Teddy all over. Um, in particular, one that I didn't know before um, being walked through it all is they have to check all of their teeth. Um, so your dog, you know, has to be friendly enough to open their mouth um, and show a, jug, a judge their teeth. Um, and now she's just like assessing all his bones and his, I guess to feel, I think with Malamutes especially, like feeling the fat and density, you know, are they a healthy weight? They're trying to find the absolute best in breed. So whilst it might look a bit odd, she's given him a good feel up just to assess all of his bone structure, his coat, everything, you know, all of, all of the grooming that we've put into it to have a look around at Teddy. And of course, he's a big friendly bear. Now, in my opinion, Freya might say something different, but this is probably the hardest bit when the other one, like Otis at the moment, was going through it. The hardest bit is trying to keep them in that stance, this standing stance of upright. So you're constantly teasing with treats and giving the occasional one to keep them in that stood up position. And um, yeah, with Teddy, I really struggled because he kept wanting to either jump up at me or sit down on his bum, which we can't let him do. And he won! He won against Otis, so he won against his brother, which was super, super happy. Um, he came away with first place, so yeah, I'm really, really proud of him. I'm proud of Otis for so getting second place, but um, yeah, look at him and his little stance. My little show dog. Oh, I can't wait to give him a big cuddle.
Teddy. Good boy, Teddy. First place. Okay, so we're now in our second show because we won the first one, we get into the next one. Um, and yeah, te in this show as well, Teddy's dad is here. So um, I'm going to point him out to you. The guy in the blue suit with the black dog in front of Teddy, Teddy's to the left and the one on the right in the guy is, that's Teddy's dad, that's Manny, his dad. Um, so yeah, Teddy's up behind him with Freya. Um, and this show is for all the best males. Um, all the males that won first in their age category, this is uh, their show. So um, these are all the winners of all of the morning shows. And then up after this will be all of the females. And then Teddy will go head to head with the winning female after this. Okay, so this will just show you the um, the stance that you need to try and maintain. And when you show, when there's quite a few in um, in the same ring, you have to hold this position for quite a while. Here's Manny up close, Teddy's daddy. Um, I'm hoping to grab him after this show um, and get him up close and personal and introduce. I don't think he knows that his um, his son's right behind him. They've never met. And. Teddy comes away with first prize in the junior dog category. So that's him winning it. And yes, yeah, so we're now on two rosettes um, for so far. So now the next competition will be him competing against the winning female, which I think will be later on this afternoon. So I think we've got a bit of a wide gap now because they have to go through all of the categories of the females before it goes boys versus girls, basically. Good boy, Teddy! Just trying to get a screenshot of a video. Can't get them too close because they're two unmuted males. But little does Teddy know that this is actually his dad. That's it. And finally, it's now four o'clock in the afternoon. It's been a very long day, but this is Teddy's final show now. He is competing against the best female. Um, this is in Teddy's age group. So best female junior against the best male junior. So the man running behind Teddy has the female. And obviously Freya's got Teddy. Freya in the red. And we're about to find out who is going to win. Will Teddy win or will... I'm actually not sure what the girl's name is, I'm sorry. I'm too focused on my own dog. Oh, look at the size of the rosette. Please, please, please. Oh, we were robbed. Robbed, I tell you. Okay, so Teddy, that means Teddy has lost to the female. So we did lose one. But for his first show, come with two rosettes. I'm very proud. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Did you miss Teddy? Did you miss him? Are you ready for him? Are you ready? I'll get him. Ready? Get him. I'm in Joe. Nico, who is it? Hi guys. Have you got your bestie back? Did you miss him? Did you miss him? Oh, because I love. Does he smell like other dogs? There you go. Okay. This is a weird one. <laughs> okay. All right. So, mister, should we show them what we got? So, guys, it's the day after we got back very... It was a long day. It was like 16 hours round trip because it was quite far away. Um, so, yeah, I didn't film last night because I was tired. Um, and I just wanted to see my baby. I'd been away all day before bed. So, um, I wanted to show you. So, we got our certificate. I think I'm supposed to write stuff on here. Um, and then we got two wins. He lost the third one. So, he lost against the female for the overall best junior. But he did win um, first place against all the boys. And he won the, what was this one? Best junior dog. But then the females are called the best junior bitch. I hope YouTube doesn't stop that. Um, hello, Miko. Um, so yeah, he won best junior dog. So yeah, so we've got that. And this means because we got the first place that we are eligible to enter Crufts, which is the biggest dog show there is. 
um, and that's in March of next year. So um, fingers crossed, um, we will be entering that one, my little champion over here. Um, it wasn't an easy task. The amount of grooming that was involved, I completely underestimated. Um, the amount of prep and the amount of posing that your dog needs to do that is not a standard Instagram photo pose, it's a proper stance, was a lot harder than I thought it would be. So yeah, really, really thankful for Freya, who is the professional dog show that handled him in the ring. And um, we've known each other years. We actually met in Aviemore on a holiday once. Um, and she's been handling since very early age um, and she showed him for me so I don't think without her we would have st stood a chance at winning it was all thanks to her um, his handsomeness helps in all of this of course but yes very very thankful very happy very proud and also kind of happy that it's over now because I felt like a lot of pressure it was a lot of sleepless nights worrying and overthinking everything <laughs>